Hey collectors, it's Chatter with Truth and I'm back with another video. What's good y'all? So I'm just lighting my stage real quick. So I was definitely getting a bunch of spiritual downloads. Okay, a lot of messages was coming through. And I'm just hearing like you know be mindful it's not funny okay you could be you could be finding yourself laughing at situations or jokes that like well, i wouldn't say jokes but you could be laughing at situations that you know not funny or you could be the type of person who always find yourself like it'll be a serious ass thing and you just you know it'd be funny to you like you the person like when something serious don't even look at you Cause you gonna laugh? Damn, it's not funny. Cause it's like I'm laughing, but it'd be like, yo, that's not even funny. But I don't know why we like this. All right, this is a big ass sage show. I know, it's taking time for it to really burn. I know I could take it a, apart and burn pieces, but I don't like doing that. So anyway, let's see. All right. All right, let's see what's going on. I'm not beautiful collector. What we need to see. Yeah, and I cut this deck. I cut it on this in the in the pre-shuffle. The grass is green on whatever side you're on. Okay, period. People left you out in the cold. People dissed you. People volleyed at you. It's like, wherever they at, these motherfuckers is not happy. They seeing like, yeah, when, when I was with the collective, it wasn't that. These people are fucking stuck on you. It's like, okay, you got evil sister studying tarot, and they want to come back home, okay? You got forged documents. So somebody, evil sister, could have did some shit and forged, um, forged your documents. You know, it could have been, like, you guys could have been living, like, some, something could have happened where... You know, whatever this person, this evil, because you got evil sister, so that's it. Whatever this evil sister was doing, okay, like, you guys could have been living together, you know, they could have got put out, or, you know, y'all not, however it go. Okay, I'm getting that this person is studying tarot now, okay, but it's like, I'm getting that copycat energy. Like, say if you were a tarot reader, um, this person is studying tarot like you now. Okay, um, I'm also getting that this somebody is, um, but they evil, so this is a dark energy. Okay, I'm getting that I'm speaking to like, like, I'm speaking to some you could, I'm getting that you read tarot or you study tarot, something like this, but it's like I'm getting like this evil twin. Okay, like, shit, this could be a twin, you know, you could be a twin or something like that, but. Or, ooh, I'm also getting somebody's twin. Like, somebody's twin flame there. They have an evil sister. Maybe a sister that didn't like, you know, y'all being together. Take away or resonate. Okay, but you got steam cooch is better. Them bitches, all them bitches is twos and threes. You're the one. Yeah, you see, you can have a lot of sisters. And it's like, the, these people envious you. They, they are envious of you. They envy you. Um... <clears throat> Somebody hygiene is not up to par either. Okay, you got to talk to God, ask for help. You could have felt like um, isolated. Like, say you got, it's like all your siblings against you. Okay, I see your mother loves you. It's like maybe, I'm, I'm getting that, I'm speaking to a chosen one, okay? And it's like, your mom loves you. You could have feel out and alone, like say if your mom is not in your life or not in your life. Um, your mom, I'm getting somebody's mom could have passed away. And it's like you thought you had, you know, family and this sibling or in this like, but it's like you're realizing that these people don't don't fuck with you. Like you really in this shit alone. That's why that talk to God here is asked for help. Somebody could be feeling like isolated or alone or like it's everybody against them. Okay, you got leveling up, new job, 
stubborn in phases. I feel like it may be some addiction that you need to heal with this addiction here. You could be stubborn to that. But I'm getting that like this could be something that they're like this could be something. It's something that you're being stubborn, whether it's to seeing or or something. But I feel like you leveling up in this new job. I do also get like if you're not in this stubborn energy, it's like this sister is stuck in their ways. This person ain't trying to change. This person could be focused, like working with the moon. Okay, this is the type of motherfucker like they gonna call you on three way calls. They gonna like it's like if they ever acting like they don't know or what's going on. It's like these people, these they be knowing. These motherfuckers be knowing. I feel like you got a sister that try to play you close. Look, I'm telling you, with this caution and black magic come out, you got a sister that's trying to play you close, but you already know what's up with her. This this somebody doing magic. I'm telling you, this person is infatuated with whatever it is that you do, and it's like they want to do it too. Yeah. I'm telling you, didn't I say you could have put somebody out? Okay, that's why that that's that they want to come back home energy. Okay, it's like you put this person out. You could have been living. You like you know what? You gotta go. This motherfucker was sitting here doing magic right under your like like I'm getting like living sleeping with the enemy. These people didn't like the way you took care of yourself, the way you carried yourself. Somebody was like, it was like these these type of motherfuckers who would do grimy shit, okay? Do grimy shit. Fuck with your your products. Fuck with your clothes. Fuck with your whatever it is you had. Like I'm telling you, terror reader in the reverse. That shit came out in the reverse. It's like this motherfucker ain't. They can't even comprehend. Like it's like they don't know. They be confused, okay. But it's like these person. This person could have jumped. I'm telling you, with this new line of study, they could have jumped and look. And then you got access to non spirit. Like hell, fucking no. I'm telling you, this person be trying to read cause they don't be understanding. Like I wouldn't give a fuck how. I'm telling you, <laughs> yo, it be your intuition. That's that's what people be feeling to realize. It's all about your intentions, and it be. It, when it ain't something ain't for you, it ain't for you, okay? You got tarot reading in the reverse. It's like, if this person, whether they study in tarot, you study in tarot, it's definitely tarot involved. But I'm getting that. And if they don't study tarot, they, but you got evil sisters studying tarot. So I'm telling you, somebody is studying tarot, they trying to see what you got going on. They, It's like this person want to try to stay ten, like steps ahead of you. I'm hearing ten, it's like, you, you can't keep up. You really can't keep up. Okay? You be seeing a lot of angel numbers at this time. This person access is completely denied. Whatever they thought they was doing, whatever research and occult things and all that is like, nah. I feel like whoever I'm speaking to, you a terror reader. And it's like you just keep leveling up on whatever it is that you're doing. Okay? And if shit been stagnant right now, it's like the things about to come in. You about to start being booked and busy. Like real shit. With the signs and symbol here, I'm telling you, it's like I'm here in service. But it's like, watch out for this. Like, you about to be seeing signs. Like, you're going to be having, like, certain things is going to be coming to you where you're going to be guided to do certain things for certain people or to say certain. Or, or this could be happening now where you'll be speaking to somebody in the street and it's like, you're that person who's coming up and just delivering messages to people. Like, you may not, like, this, I'm telling you, this is something. Like, so she, like, it's, cause this could have happened to you, you know, like a lot of times when people come and tell you things like where, you know, but it's like, you about to be that person. You're about to be that spiritualist. That's really walking up to people and giving them knowledge that like delivering messages directly to people. Somebody is mad that they cannot do what you do. And this person is heavy in magic. I'm telling you, they are heavy in that fucking magic. This type of somebody, somebody carry like black fellas with them and shit like that. Like, what the hell? I'm telling you, somebody, yo, I can't make it up. You got submersion emotions, skeletons, copycat, and shook. I'm telling you, 
somebody got some heavy emotions for you and they try to conceal that shit that the hate that they have in their heart for you they try to keep that shit concealed like a motherfucker but it's like they was they what they be doing about to be revealed this copycat and i'm telling you it's like whoever you are the same way you have spiritual gifts you know y'all come from the same it's like somebody is like an evil twin i'm getting that heavy like it's like you may not be the you and this person may not physically be twins but it's like y'all come from the same this from the same bloodline it's just that this person used their gifts for for bad and not for good period and that's why it's been so hard for you because it's like y'all y'all got the same gifts i can't make it up not the same gifts because see their access is being denied you're being guided right now i'm telling you they not say their access is being denied they're being terminated from from whatever gifts that they had or that they was using i'm telling you this could be somebody who life was very successful you know that like they were getting everything that they wanted out of life the the job, the 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 life, the, the the career, the family. It's like this person, if they was married, if they had kids, it's like they going through a divorce, they getting separated, the kids are getting separated, they losing their job, all sorts of shit is happening. Their whole world is crumbling down for what they were trying to do to you behind the scenes. This is like this person had the life. It's like, but they were not you. You know what I'm saying? And they didn't like. However, whatever it was that you were doing, it's like they didn't like that. It's like we all here on our own spiritual paths and journeys. Like what what I'm doing ain't got shit to do with you what you doing. And it's like I feel like somebody didn't like how you were leveling up in life, how you were things was happening. I'm telling you, you could have been going through where shit was starting to take off for you now. And now you getting new jobs and now you doing this person didn't like that. You know, this could have been even an older sibling with somebody where, you know, they took care of you a lot or they um supported you and it's like when you started getting on your own two feet and doing what you know making a better living for yourself they didn't like that they didn't like when you ain't need them no more okay and it's like this person could have seen that you was leveling up quick and fast and it's like they tried to stop that they instead of focusing on what they had going on they wanted to copy and mimic whatever it was that you had going on and it's like bro folk if you focused on your own path you wouldn't have nothing to worry about Somebody was too try, too focused on trying to do what it is that you do. Look, I'm telling you, somebody is mad. Somebody is mad. They mad. They spell work is not working with the spell work in the reverse. Like you got spell work and gratitude. I'm telling you, somebody is upset. They childish as fuck. That's just confirming people be, they heated. Heavy spell work is being done because it's like you're celebrating life. You're leveling up. I'm t damn. All right, let me put these cards down because once, 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 um, card keep fucking falling out my hand. Yeah, I'm telling you, you got wrong way in life purpose in the reverse. See, what they were doing was not their fucking life purpose. It was yours. Okay, and because they went the wrong, I'm telling you, you ain't got shit to worry about. Wow, I seen 1333 on the phone. You don't got shit to worry about. Relax, because everything that they do, that they did or been doing is catching up to them. I'm telling you, this wasn't their life purpose. It was yours. You reading tarot, you studying, whatever it may have been. But I'm picking up a tarot reader. It's like, now this person wouldn't do that. But it's like, their intentions is not pure. They want to see. It's like, this person strictly wanted to fucking do tarot to see what was going on with you. Book and readings, lying to motherfuckers, confusing motherfuckers, doing shit for money. Like, people's intentions do not be pure. Astro travel. I'm telling you. Now they having these out of body experiences. Supernatural shit is happening to them. Yeah, I'm telling you, look, you got altercation and missing piece in the reverse. See, somebody tried to create some sort of altercation for you, but they really can't. It's like, because you already know what's going on. You already know their intentions. I'm telling you, this is the type of person, yeah, the grass is fake. You got a motherfucker who will call you, try to gossip about somebody, gossip about the other one. And it's like, because it's, it's multiple people. You can have multiple sisters or like, I'm telling you, whether it's sister, friend, however, take away a resume. But you're like, these motherfuckers gossip about you, all sorts of shit. 
want to put you on a three-way, want to see if you're going to say something about the other. Like, you don't give a fuck about none of these people. And it's like, all they do is sit and watch in amazement. It's like somebody, all right, it's okay to be inspirational, but when you start getting upset and send an evil eye because you can't do what this person do or move how this person move, okay, this type of person, this the type of motherfucker, yeah, you got therapists in the reverse. It's like they don't want the help. They don't want to seek help and nothing. They stuck in their ways. You got the stubborn card out. Somebody is very stuck in their ways, okay? But it's like... Yeah, you leaving this shit the fuck behind. You leaving this shit behind. And I feel like somebody, I'm telling you, with this cash flow and confused, somebody tried to keep you confused about some money. I'm telling you, they wanted you to be codependent. Somebody could even be acting like they got some sort of money. They don't have it. But somebody wanted, somebody, somebody wanted you to be confused about some money too. Mm-hmm. And I feel like you could have started, yeah, with this transformation here, you could have started st studying terror. And this is how you started finding the answer, finding out shit, you know, but this was your life purpose. This is how you were supposed to get to where you going. Okay. This motherfucker trying to do, I'm telling you, it was meant for you to be. This is your gift. This is your gift. Somebody lying, projecting on like, bro. This ain't no somebody. This is fucking evil ass sister. Period. That was the first card out. Somebody got an evil ass sister. Somebody try to steal your gift. Like, what the fuck? I'm telling you, this person is bound. Yeah, with this magician and hermit. <clears throat> This person was really trying to man look to this empress, trying to keep you isolated and alone. That's why I said they didn't want nobody, but it's like they didn't know all you was the all that caused you to do was go within the soul search. For real. I'm getting that somebody could have like a Virgo in their chart. They're not a Virgo son. They got Virgo placements in their chart. But this motherfucker, yeah, with this death and rebirth, is like, yeah, you going within them. I'm telling you, it's just like you just started seeing things differently. Now you got the Six of Swords. It's like these people don't like that you move forward. And they trying to create a lot of chaos and conflict. A lot of chaos and conflict. But this Knight of Wands here. Somebody definitely doing magic. Like, this this person be... And they go with, like, this This somebody who go to, like, covens and shit like that. This person, or, or they be dark. They could be beating on drums, like, light and candy. They do, they do a lot of fuck shit. A lot of fuck shit. And it's like, they don't even be knowing what they be doing. They just be thinking, oh, because I got, this, like, this all this spiritual shit. Oh, I know. Like, no, you look fucking stupid. You think covering your head and shit is going to stop that karma from coming? Hell no, motherfucker. Like, somebody be having scarves and shit wrapping around their head. Like, just doing the most. Looking stupid. Looking stupid. Okay, yeah, with this page of swords, queen of cups, <laughs> queen of swords. Yeah, you got judgment. Look with the five of wands and the three of cups. I'm telling you, whatever these people was doing, they going through judgment. Whatever chaos and conflict they was trying to cause, they going through judgment. I feel like it's like whatever they be studying, it's like you you do this shit naturally. Somebody is studying you like a fucking book too. But see, I feel like whatever they think they got to study and read in a book or they over, I read this in the book. It's like, bro, you you do this shit with no effort. You do this shit with no effort. And I feel like you somebody who is very loving, very caring, very nurturing, but you cut a bitch. Okay? And this is why these people do shit in the background. They fucking dibble and dabble in magic in the background because they know they cannot fuck with it. They cannot fuck with you. They cannot fuck with you. 
they cannot fuck with you on the soul level, on the physical level, none of that shit. Hating, like that's some hating shit, yeah. And now you got this Eight of Cups, not eight, Knight of Swords, <clears throat> Eight of Pentacles. It's like somebody is upset that you walked away. And I'll tell you, this person, this is this what they be looking like. They be thinking they doing something. Then I say, look, somebody, this is a white feather, but somebody be having feathers and shit. But this person don't know. They is like, they tied to that shit. Whatever they were doing. Whatever they was doing. This moon and secrecy, huh? Then I look, I can't make it up. Eight of swords. Somebody is like, they tied to that shit. Meanwhile, you getting new blessings coming in your way. This person really thought that they was doing something in secrecy or like something wasn't going to come out or you wasn't going to know that they doing this shit. Like, fuck off. I don't know one thing about it. People be evil as fuck. And they mad that they can't, they can't sit with you. They really fuck. That's what they really mad at. You got friendship, patience, and adversity. They, this ain't a sister. This is a friend. But I do feel like you are, like, say you been like, damn. Like, I'm telling you, because somebody feel fucking isolated and alone a little bit. It's like, not like that, but it's like, you feel outcasted or like, damn, why I don't have nobody? Like, you would think being, it's just us. You know what I'm saying? That we will be close. We will be friends. Like, no, these motherfuckers is evil. And it's like, I feel like being spirit is want you to be patient because you're about to have friendships come into your life that are going to be meaningful, that are going to be special, that, you know, they're going to appreciate you. This is going to be friends that's, that's, that's more so sisters. Yeah, I see sir, grief and surrender. Okay, so it's like surrender that, yeah, and then you got purpose behind this. It's like somebody is hurt behind it. It's like you you don't expect your fucking flesh and blood to really be coming up against you and trying to sabotage your fucking whole life. Like you're like, damn, we we family, we all we got. And you you trying to be mad shisty and grimy to me. But this is all your life purpose. People coming in, I'm telling you, you're gonna meet your soul child. Friends that's really gonna turn like blood ain't gonna make y'all no closer because the, the the siblings that you have or dealing with these motherfuckers do not like you. Period. Period. And this may not, like, say this could be, like, a half-sister or, like, where y'all got the same mother, different fathers, or the same father, different mothers. You know, something like that. But like I said, this person was spiritually gifted as well. They just used their shit to, to, to try to stop you from using yours. You know, they want to keep you stuck, want to keep you codependent. Like, damn, like, let me spread my wings and fly. Why are you trying to hold me back? Okay, if you feeling isolated and alone, talk to God for real. Like, I already, I, I get it. That shit be fucked up. But I feel like the more you, you spend time alone, the more your spiritual gifts is opening up anyway. Okay? So that's the message that I have for you all. And until next time.